Welcome to the Short Book Summaries channel enjoy and subscribe if you like our work. The personal memoir of a manic depressive and an authority on the subject describes the onset of the illness during her teenage years and her determined journey through the realm of available treatments. An autobiography of a brilliant woman who suffered from manic depression, she resists the more watered-down label bipolar because she thinks it hides the essential nature of the disease. She made it through a PhD in psychology and became one of the foremost authorities in her field before finally getting the consistent treatment she needed. Just seeing how she was able to achieve such professional success while privately dealing with such hellish, frightening moments of near insanity is enough to be massively impressed. If you've ever looked at the world and thought it was so full of amazing things that you couldn't sleep for days, or alternatively, if you've ever spent days just imagining every single living thing on the earth dying slowly, I believe she actually describes compulsively thinking of this during high school, then the feelings aren't that new. But she paints a cohesive picture of what it's like to live as a never-ending captive to these seesawing feelings. She also gives clear insight into why people may resist taking medicine that dulls their manic moments, because they may feel so much more alive, productive, and vibrant during these spells. I really enjoyed this book. It's incredibly well written. The author, she's truly brilliant. She comes across as completely honest and she allows herself to be vulnerable in the telling of her story, which makes her exceedingly likable. K. Redfield Jameson is a psychologist, a professor of psychiatry and an authority on bipolar disorder, and suffers from the condition herself. And she's written a terrific book about bipolar disorder and her life experience. And no, I'm not using too much hyperbole.